We the best at uh, uh, soccer, football, right? Uh, what else? Basketball, tennis, baseball. What else? Boxing. What else we the best at? Boxing, tennis. gymnastics, tennis. Right track and field, everything. Everything we do, we do better than the so-called white man. Because he's a base man. He deserves to be in change. Right for the things he did to the God's chosen people, man. Your people are going into slavery and America is falling. That's right. Y'all deserve slavery. And it don't matter, oh, I didn't enslave nobody. I didn't do anything. Your forefathers did. Your forefathers did. You got to pay for that thing, man. Y'all ain't going to get away. Esau, you can't get away, man. Y'all gonna be put to death for the things you did. Your forefathers have done. And today, right? All the hidden, hidden, uh, uh, what you call that? Secret societies, a uh, uh, secret council, right? Redlining, all these things y'all do to us to oppress us daily, keep us on the bottom. Y'all gonna pay for that. Right, Esau? You gonna pay for that, man. Right? You and your children gonna pay for that. Right in slavery. Right. Right in chains, man. I can't wait. Come. Lord willing, I get to see that day, man. I can't wait to put y'all in chains. I'm, I'm sick of working for y'all, man. Y'all y'all the y'all a base people. And we are we we the gods on the earth. And we subject to y'all, man. Right? This kingdom has to fall, man. You black, Hispanic, and Native Americans, y'all need to wake the hell up, man. I'm sick of being here, yo. So let me come. It's the job. We gotta do the job. Got man. Elon walking out here, loving his life, still looking dirty as ever, like he in damn India. Like, got Esau out here. Everybody having a good time, but nobody want to hear the word of the Lord. Sister, you know your nationality, sister. Well, you're an Israelite, sister. You're not black. You're not African American. You're God's chosen people. The seed is planted, man. Right? And I know y'all hear me. That's all I'm looking for. Y'all get planted. Sister, you know your nationality, sister? She can't. Okay. And she, and she got the air cones in. She, she got an excuse. But she don't, though. The most I know she hurts. Hey, man. Everybody get marked, man. Let me get 1 Corinthians chapter 3 and verse 5. Huh? Actually, you can start at verse 6. Who's up? Bring it out, though. The book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 3 and verse 6. Bring it out. I have planted, Apollo watered, but God gave the increase. The Most High God gave the increase. No, read verse 5, by Salah. Read verse 5. Yeah. It's the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 3 and verse 5. Three. Who then is Paul? And who is Apollo? Uh -huh. But ministers by whom ye believe, Three. even as Yahweh gave to every man. I have planted Apollo. Water, but got watered by God. But God gave the increase. Most high God gave the increase. So all we here to do is just tell you, and that's it. We can plant the seed. And it's up to you to go search out these things. Right? It's up to you to, to pursue the most high God. Right? It ain't up to us to do it for you. We can't save your own. We can't, you know, secure your own salvation. That's, that's for you to do. But we here to plant the seed, man. Let me get Ezekiel chapter 33. You can start at verse 1. And I'm going to close out with that chapter. Man. Pop it like it's hard, pop it like it's hard, pop it like it's hard. Come on, Jake, with the body, man. Ezekiel 33, start at verse 1. This is the book of Ezekiel, chapter 33 and verse 1. Bring it out. Again, the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man, speak to the children of thy people, and say unto them, when I bring this, when I bring the sword upon the land, if the people of the land take a man of their coast and set him for their watchman, if when he seeth the when he seeth the sword come upon the land, he blow the trumpet and warn the people. So right now, this is what we doing. We blowing the trumpet, right? You so-called Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans are God's chosen people, man. right? Jesus Cristo no blanco. Yeah. Jesus Cristo el negro. Negro. See? See. Así es. Right? Read.
Verse 4. Then whosoever heareth the sound of the trumpet and taketh not warning, if the sword come and take him away, his blood shall be upon his own head. So your blood's gonna be upon your hand, right? You can walk by, have a good day. I don't wanna hear the Bible today. I'm gonna keep walking. I'm trying to go get some funnel cake and lay with and commit adultery with this girl I'm, I'm com currently committing adultery with. Right? You had to pair with another man's wife. Right? You know you ain't supposed to be out here. You bold for being out here. There's a lot of people out here. If you are committed to adultery, you bold, man. Right? You want to just have a good day, go commit adultery, get some funnel cake, walk the pair, right? Get a little, little sandy and little toes and stuff to go home and, and, and tear down another man's wife or tear down another man's husband. Y'all gonna be put to death, man. Right? You want to ignore the word of God, man. You're gonna, you're gonna die. You're gonna die in these last days, man. I'm, I'm just saying straight up like that. You are gonna die in these last days, man. That's right. Right? If you don't repent and come back to the Most High God, you're gonna perish. The same judgment that Esau is getting, you're gonna get that judgment. That fiery, that fiery judgment you're gonna get when your eye socket, your eyes gonna melt out your eye sockets, your tongue gonna melt out your mouth, right? You 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 think burning your hand on the stove by accident is hot? Wait till you, wait till you, wait till them nuclear missiles come. come. Wait, till, wait till that hit America. Wait till one of those hit uh, 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 New York and it reaches all the way down here. That's right. Right, and the damn Eiffel Tower land on the beach. <laughs> right, wait till that happened. Right? You go, that's gonna be some fire for you. That's gonna be some hot fire. Let me get 2 Peter 3 and 9. All right, read. It's the book of 2 Peter, chapter 3 and verse 9. The Lord is not slack. Slack it. The Lord is not slack concerning his promises, as some would count slackness. So the Most High God is not slack concerning his promises, man. Let me get Ecclesiastes chapter 8, verse 11. That's what I want. Uh, 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 somebody, damn, what is it called? He say when, when somebody, their, their mind is fully set into do wickedness because judgment is not executed speedily. That's 8 and 11. Bring it out. Get from the top of that. It's the book of Second Peter. Oh. Chapter 3 and verse 9. Bring it out. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, as some would count slackness. As some would count slackness. Everybody think the Lord is late. Everybody think the most high God is, is just up there kicking his feet up. And, and well, he, he is. You know, the angels are putting in work right now. You think you think he's slack and he just forgot about his people? No, he didn't. You think he just forgot about all the things he's gonna do and prophesy to do to this earth in these last days, right? Read. But is long suffering to usward, not willing that any should perish. So not willing that any should perish, man. This is why he's sending us out here. He's he he built up our spirit. We didn't know each other from a can of paint, man, all over the city. But he brought us together to to, to preach to our people to repent and come out of America, man. Come out. Of come out of America ways and, 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 and come back to the most high God's laws, man. Right? Read. But that all should come to repentance. But that all should come to repentance and not perish. Read. Verse 10. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night. He said the day of the Lord's gonna come as a thief in the night. Ain't nobody gonna know what's gonna happen. Right? Read. In which the heavens shall go away with the great noise. And the elements, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. He said the elements shall melt with fervent heat. What how, what's gonna melt the elements? What's gonna melt sand? What's gonna make this sand turn into glass, right? What's gonna make these buildings turn into liquid, liquid stone, right? What's gonna turn this this, this wood and wooden pier into ash, right? Read. The earth also and the works that are therein shall be burnt up. Everything's gonna be burnt up in these last days, right? Ain't ain't ain't, ain't nothing ain't nothing gonna escape the Most High God's judgment, right? Read. Verse eleven. Seeing then that all these things shall be di dissolved, what manner of person ought ye to be? So seeing that all these things are gonna happen, what manner of person ought ye to be? You wanna be an adulterous person in these last days? Right, you wanna be being disobedient to the Most High God? You wanna be caught in the club when that sky cracks open twerking? Right? You wanna, you wanna be caught uh, committing adultery? You wanna be caught stealing from your brother, robbing your brother? Right? You wanna be caught hating your sister? 
You want to be caught doing these things in the last days when that sky cracks open? You don't. Because you're going to be put to death for that, man. You want to be found doing righteous things. Right? Read. What manner of person ought ye be in all holy conversation and godliness? Right, well, all holy conversation and godliness, man. This is why we tell y'all to repent, man, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Let me get Luke 13 and verse 5. What you got, up? Uh, you got preset? That's 2nd Andrews 5 and 42. 2nd Andrews 5 and 42? All right, let, let me get that in Please answer. Bring that out real quick. No, nah, that's, nah, that's what you're looking for. 2nd Andrews 5 and 42. Nah, that's not right there. No, nah, that's Please answer. That's the right. All right, nah, bring that out. 8 and 11. This is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 8, verse 11. Bring it out. Because sentence against an evil work is not excluded speedily, executed speedily. Therefore, the heart of the sons of men is fully set in them to do evil. So he said, because judgment isn't executed speedily, you know, for sin and wickedness, you know, you're fully set in the ways of what you're gonna do, right? Because you know the Most High God ain't gonna smite you down tomorrow. You know, man, I'm, I'm gonna just smash his wife real quick. And I'm gonna repent later, man. I can't. I can't. I couldn't resist. He was too thick, right? That's that's off, man. You can't be doing that, right? The Most High God is fully against that, right? Oh, I know. I know. I know. He's married, but he is so fine. I, I just had to let him in. No, man. You already. The man that you lay with is your husband. That's right. That's your, that's your husband in your head, right? And just imagine if we kept that law amongst our people, right? There would be less strife. Nobody would be getting killed. Right? Because there's a lot of a lot of talking goes on. Nobody will be getting murdered. It would be no strife in our community. Little to none, I'll say that. If we actually had some respect and moral for each other, right? If you looked after your sister and, and, and your brother, and you know that he's married, and you know that she's married, right? And she's betrothed to somebody. Don't let her lay with that man. I don't care if y'all out at the bar with the girls and she go back with some man and you covering for her. No, that's off. You're gonna be judged for that too.